Hey guys, it's Sierra. Today I wanted to tell you a little bit about prion diseases. You may have heard of some of them. They include mad cow disease, fruitful Jacobs disease, chronic wasting disease, and scrappy. They're, um, they're all caused by a misformed prion protein. This, um, this prion protein, scientists aren't quite sure what it does when it's formed correctly, but when it's malformed, it can cause some severe problems. These problems include incessant itching and scrappy, extreme agitation and apparent symptoms of mental instability in any sufferers, and complete insomnia for sufferers of fatal familial insomnia. Prion diseases in all cases are fatal, without exception, because we haven't yet found a cure for them. Because they're formed out of a protein instead of a virus, or even a bacteria, then all the rules have changed with how to um, cure them, treat them, how they're caused, and how they spread. There are three different ways that you can get a prion disease. One is inherited. The uh, Another is random. You can just randomly get it from a problem in your genetic code. And um, the third is from human intervention. The um, human intervention cases are from like scrappy and sheep from in and in breeding and, and mad cow disease from feeding cows animal proteins, some of which probably came from scrappy infected sheep. There's nothing you can do to prevent getting a prion disease, so don't even bother and don't freak out. The likelihood that you'll even be exposed to one or even see someone who has one is very, very slim. They seem to be relatively uncommon. And as long as protocols are followed with the slaughter, feeding, breeding, and consuming of animals, then there is nothing to worry about. The source I primarily used was a book, The Family That Couldn't Sleep, by D.T. Knapp. It's a very good book. I'd recommend you read it. It details all about prion diseases, how they're caused, um, different, different research on them and all that in a really interesting way. I'd recommend you read it. So, yeah, see you guys. Bye.